Aries, beautiful queens and handsome kings, welcome to Unique and Odd Apologetic. How you doing, beautiful queens and handsome kings? Subscribers, unsubscribers, and cross-watchers, welcome, beautiful queens and handsome kings. I'd like to thank anybody that's got a personal read or donated to my channel. I love you, beautiful queens and handsome kings. Subscribers, did I say subscribers, unsubscribers, cross-watchers, welcome. All right, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. Y'all got three. Phoenix, that's how's that happily ever after? So whoever thought they was throwing you a uh, um, storm in your life, they they seeing that you a rising phoenix. That, that book says once upon a time. Guess what? They... They was in the fantasy that didn't get to complete their little fantasy story. Cause you a phoenix. And them trying to duck, them trying to burn you up. You a rising phoenix. You protested against that shit. Excuse me. You brought a tower moment on whoever your enemies was. And that's three people. So you had somebody that thought they was gonna put you in the third party and take your castle? Nah, nah, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. Start a revolution. You start a revolution on their ass. You brought the tower down on their ass. You, yeah, you start speaking your mind and said, I know you're a bitter bitch or a bitter bum. Yes, thorns. Weave together the crown you deserve. God reminded this, them that you is the queen. You the beautiful queen. You the king. You the handsome king. They're not taking your throne. They tried to burn you up with a storm. Whatever fantasy they was in, trying to write a story, look, the pages, they, they book still going to be blank. Oh, I guess I went here first. Start a revolution. You've been looking around and noticing that the world is often unjust. But you're not sure what to do about it. Like Cadmus, you decide to sp first speak on your own revolution. Educate yourself. Stand up for yourself. Don't forget to stand up for others. Whether or not you have shared experience or you speak up and do safely, then you do it. Some of these people taught you that not only was you beautiful queens and handsome kings, but you was going to speak up for others and teach others to speak up for themselves and remind them. You was born on the throne. Nobody could ever take your throne. It's yours. How's that happily ever after? See that question mark? How's that happily after? They, they made you a rising phoenix. No matter how hopeless you may be feeling at this moment, know this. You can and will survive whatever trials have been put you have been put through. From the ashes of the past, you shall create a story book ending filled with beauty and resilience and handsome and resilience. All future flames will cower when they hear the whispering of your name. So not only did they lose the battle, they will cower when they hear your name. When you speak, whether you speak in a room by yourself or you speak to the world, they're going to cower. Because you done brought a tower moment on their ass. You protested. You started a revolution. Why they thought they was going to be in the third party and bring it down? No. You started a revolution. Look at these thorns. Weave together the crown you deserve. This right here. Hey. The ultimate card of celebration. Not just for yourself. You're amazing though. But for those around you. When you're done putting on your crown each and every morning, go and help someone else put on theirs. You have so much love and wisdom to spread. So don't waste it. Self-love is essential, but community is important too. I'm a cross watcher, beautiful queens and handsome kings. I was in that storm with y'all, but it made me a rising phoenix to be able to protest, to speak loud, to remind my other beautiful queens and handsome kings that we're going to weave our thorns together and we're going to show our enemies they ain't shit. And they can't stop us. That's why I say royal family. We're going to uplift each other.
So we got passion for each other. We're going to start them new ideas, them new journeys, them new relationships. Whether it's getting a promotion at your job or starting your own. Whether it was letting go of that bitter bitch or bitter bum, whether it was lover, family, or friend, they were karmics to teach you a lesson for your blessings. You once glimpsed your true potential. <laughs> New abilities to express creativity. An unpredictable force changed you. They tried to burn you up in the ashes that made you a phoenix. It was an unpredictable force of that third party to come against you. But you protested and started a revolution and reminded them, I'm a handsome king, I'm a beautiful queen, the crown, this throne is mine and you will not take it. I'm going to weave my throne and I'm going to put it on my head every day. Hey. <laughs> mm. And the angel said, baby, you are protected. Thank you for staying patient, because balance is yours. You live a pure extension. Your heart is pure, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. Your enemies' hearts wasn't, but yours was. Reconstruction begins today. Start a revolution. An important friendship arises. You're gonna. You. We are reminding our other royal families. Let's throw on our throne. Let's throw on our crowns. We wake up every morning putting our crowns on. We are not defeated. Yeah. We made plans and decisions. Plans and decisions not to be juggled. And your enemies, when you started that revolution to protest against the ass, see that happily ever after didn't work out very much for them because they seen they made a, a bad decision and bad planning because they can't no longer juggle you mentally physically or financially castle was always yours They were spying and gossiping on about you, trying to manipulate with the situation that didn't come out in their best favor. Mm. It says, have a childlike perception of the world. A balance between heart and mind gains a mature perception of the world. Karmics are here to teach you lessons for your blessings. They taught you that, I always say, I never disrespect you and say you didn't love yourself, but they taught you. Your enemies taught you that people was taking your kindness for weakness, whether it was lovers, family, friends. Look, past, we talking about them. People you used to treasure memories with that was manipulators, gossiping behind your back, spying on you to try to destroy you, burn you up in the ashes. They taught you to snatch your love back for yourself. And no one could take your kindness for weakness no more. And guess what? Now you're walking away and you don't even treasure making any more memories with their ass no more. You was innocent in this situation. Time to take a leap of faith. You had that protest. Yeah, it says, a blind journey was taken. A new undertaking has begun. A joyful mistake will be made. It was a mistake for whoever this joker was to have joy and gossiping about you, trying to manipulate you. It was the biggest mistake they ever made in their life. Because not only do you still have your throne, the world's going to see they motherfucking act. You know, jokers. Jokers come steal, kill, 
and destroy like the devil. But back in the day, you know how jokers did entertained the raw. It was entertainment because guess what? It says a new undertake a un new undertaking has become. They still just entertainment. They jokers. They joke they sell. Who thought you was gonna be crying over spilled milk? You know there's two other cups. You going to your blessing. Thank them for the lesson, but they ass definitely gonna be crying over spilled milk. Yeah. Thought they was gonna keep you in decision or blinded. You not. You not. You not. You not. You made decisions to go on rapid journeys. Even though they was frustrating you, trying to bring obstacles and delays in your life. Yeah. Some of these people thought their secrets was going to stay secrets. Mm. They still got secrets. But the biggest secret is, guess what? You ain't going to burn. You still a phoenix. <laughs> Caught in an impossible illusion. Many things are not as they seem. A new understanding of others. A new understanding is that whatever they kept in the dark, you still a rising phoenix while they was trying to keep it dark that they was trauma bonding you. While they was calling trauma or abandonment, trying to destroy you, gossiping, lying, manipulating, spying. Only thing, only secret that's kept in the dark is guess what? They, how's that happily ever after? Cause it didn't come out for him, did it? Didn't come out for the player. You know, Knight of Cups is player for me. So somebody tried yo-yo. Knights come in and out. Somebody thought they was gonna be able to yo-yo you and keep on coming in and out of your life, trying to take your compassion for weakness, take your kindness for weakness. Only weakness is they showing that they weak. Daydream of achieving goals. Add an imitation. Imagination to a relationship, a important message arrived. They was adding imagination to, they was wanted you to imagine a fake ass relationship. Guess what? They imagined that they was gonna burn you up in the mashes and you a rising phoenix. Their imagination go far than a motherfucker, don't it? Guess what? A important message has arrived. Message! They started a revolution on their own self. So. And you, you you weaved your crown together, and you a rising phoenix. They didn't burn you up. They didn't burn you up. But they brought their own darkness through secrets of towers. Look at these towers. They brought their own tower, being manipulative, gossip, and being cruel to you in the dark. 